In this video, I'll show you how to fix your Epson EcoTank ET2760 in case it's printing white pages, blank pages. Nothing is here at all. Well, this could be because of many different reasons. It could be a software issue or it could be also a hardware issue. Maybe your print head is clogged and I'll show you many ways how to fix this problem. So let's get started. Before going any further and before you start trying many other complicated things, the simplest thing you can do is to go on the back of your printer and disconnect it from power. Okay, so disconnect this power cable. You can also disconnect the other end that connects to your AC outlet and wait five minutes. After five minutes, go ahead and connect it back. Turn on your printer, wait and try printing again. Many times this solves your issue and you do not have to do anything else after that. If you're still having the same problem, do not worry. I have other solutions and the next one is to simply check on your computer that your Epson EcoTank printer is the only one enabled. You may have multiple uh, printers connected to your computer but only this one should be enabled. Another thing you can try is to update the firmware of your machine. In my case, it's giving me a message about two minutes after the printer got turned on, but in case you do not get this message and you may still have a firmware update available to you, I'll show you how to get there from the menu. So over here, press settings, go here, press OK. And from here, navigate by pressing these arrows, the left and right arrows, until you see firmware update press ok you need to press on the first one where it says update once then press ok it will now check to see if you have an update pending and if you have one you just have to press ok and then press yes wait until it's done and try printing again when this process complete Finally, if none of these solutions worked for you, I have a final one. Just go into the settings, press OK, go into maintenance, press OK again. And here you need to go where it says head cleaning, because there's a good chances that your print heads are clogged. Probably you didn't use this printer for a long time. Maybe just after a week or two, the heads can get clogged. And uh, what you need to do is to press head cleaning here, OK, and press OK once more and the cleaning will start. It will use a bit of ink, so, um, so don't get surprised if the ink level goes just slightly lower, not a lot of it. Also make sure you have some paper inserted uh, in the paper tray over there and you should be good to go. If after doing this you see an improvement but it's still not totally normal. There's still some lines or anything. You can go, let me show you, not over head cleaning, but choose power cleaning. This is the same exact thing, it's just more powerful. It will use more ink and it will take a bit, of, a bit more time. So these are the two last things you can try and most of the cases, this is the last resort and this is what it works. So thanks for watching. If you have other solutions, please leave them in, com in the comments down below. If not, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.